end of the day look at that holy moly blue sky basin what's up guys how's it going mark 408 we're doing a car jump for you we got scott he's got his gasoline he's gonna try and light something on fire it was we were uh, doing some target practice early and it was super windy like couldn't even hear each other it was so windy so we weren't gonna do it and then of course we wrapped up and now the wind has died so the convertible dodge we've had it for so long and we've run out of ideas and you know what it's and time and we ran out of gas and we ran out of gas gas and ideas and hope so we're gonna jump it today get rid of it because uh the old durango over there is done so we need to get rid of that and then get some freshies for the winter i'd like to get a few four by fours or all-wheel drives because you know winter down here I got a lot of stuff in my head. I got drone, NoCo, GoPro, blow, blow. Oh, this should be fun. All this stuff fly out when it jumps. Yeah, gas or diesel lean. I don't know what it is anymore. With a convertible like that, maybe, maybe it runs on kerosene now. Probably one of those hydrogen fuel. Yeah. It's actually a Tesla. <laughs> Look at that. Nice little sunset jump for us. Right? Gonna blast right into the sun. Blast and never come back. No cleanup. All right, let's get this thing gassed up. Yeah, I don't know. Dump half of it. That's premium. I paid a buck ninety eight the other day for that. Wow. I know. It's for the dirt bike. You know, like you know what? I don't want to drive the gas station right now, so just grab that. More speed. More speed. More cowbell. Let's do this. What if we what? Just knock this off with a hammer. Oh, that'd be too easy. Then it won't latch. I think we should go hood up for the jump. Like this, like straight up? Yeah. No, it'll, it usually opens itself. Yeah. yeah. Wind power. All right, we got the, the no-co. We're going to put the windows down. So we have glass everywhere. <laughs> Look at this disaster. This is my shifter now, by the way. <laughs> got nothing. I can't tell what gear I'm in. Yeah. You sure? Did I hold down the white button? I forget. Come, Come on, Dodge. Don't be dying on us now. 309. Hey, take the take the red one off and then hold down the button. Sometimes it doesn't like to do what it's told. Sweet airbag, eh? Good now? Sure. Nothing. I don't think it's in park. It's not <laughs> I don't know. I have a check. Noka's good to go. It's just this thing. This is our shifter currently. I'm trying every gear here. Come on. Yeah, literally trying everything. What's on the brake? Push the brake hard because I remember the brake Yeah, brake shouldn't matter. All right, give us a few minutes here. I'm in the high end there now with the tank of gas, giving a little push, seeing if, I don't know, Knock some sensor around. Can you bump start automatic? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know. They like my mustache, by the way. All right, let's go see if that did anything. Easy on day. Nothing. What the heck? All we did was tow it back. It started up earlier. It was out of gas. We I started it. it. When you were pushing, I dropped it into drive. And nothing? Nothing. It's in park now? Uh, right now. Yes. So it was over there. We wanted to move it because we were doing some target practice. And it was out of gas. So we put it in neutral. It started for like two seconds. So we put it in neutral and just towed it over here. And then now it's got nothing. These freaking dodges, I tell you. Junk. Junk. We are now boosting from the Hyundai. Ugh. Yeah. It's 
definitely not that, it's something else. Nothing. Give me a little bump forward. <laughs> Guess I should. One more. Come on, Dodge. Don't be that guy. Guess we're not jumping it today. I don't know. I don't know what the heck happened, man. Well, that was a big fail, unfortunately. But it is getting dark anyways. I don't even know how to look at this light. But yeah. I don't know. Maybe we'll try again tomorrow. So maybe the Dodge needs to sit and think about what we've done. So... Any any ideas, Scott? Kick it, yeah. Maybe we need to hammer the starter. Nice uh, four wheel jacket you got there. It's nice, eh? Sneaky. Sneaky. I used to figure skate. Oh, nice. Yeah, I can I can tell by your by your figure. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see you when we see you. And it is a new day. What's up, guys? How's it going? A little warm out today. We're gonna try and do more stuff again. So I was at Lockhart's this morning. Filmed the new Gen Five Ski Doo. Uh, XRS, MXZ XRS with Smart Shocks thing is absolutely amazing. Of course, I want one now. And Razor J has arrived. And he's brought uh, his Razor. He's got the bull aids on it. And he's got some fresh radius rods on the back, I believe. Look at this truck. Needs a wash. Needs a wash. All right, what do we got here? Yeah, these rims look good. The old bull aids. Hello. What's up? How are you? We're back. Fresh out of bed. Fresh out of bed. <laughs> I'm all refreshed now. Oh man. I woke up with a sore neck yesterday, Jay. I can like I can't even put it back. What even just uh I don't know. I think I'm sick. Where probably got the hurt? probably got the vid. Even just like swallowing like the muscles in the back of my neck. I sound like a freaking teacher. Anyways, look at these things. Holy How beefy is that? So those are the Super ATV ones. Yep. Which are absolutely insane. They're like Size of my leg. There's no way that will ever break. If you break that, I'd be yeah, thoroughly in impressed. Box, in, in a box that way, they're super strong. Yeah, I feel like Super ATV would be thoroughly impressed too. And, and then the these are them. these are your Atlas ORV arms, which are also pretty awesome. Yeah. And they're color matched with the Super ATV arms. So. Yeah. Look at that. Look at you. Yeah, these. Uh, so these basically are the same. I don't know. They're the same grade as the ZRP ones. If you guys know okay. ZRP, so basically the same. They're made out of 7075 aluminum, which is super strong. Most stuff is 6061. Uh, so this is just a step, the next step. Fancy. And the price reflects that. Like it's. A, I don't know. I, I think they're well priced for what you get. I mean, it's a lot of engineering going in these. And then I also got these. So they're they're uh, my. Uh, uh, sway bar, the sway, sway bar, bar, my sway bar links. Uh, the ones were like paper thin on the other one. Are those uh, also Atlas? Yeah, they're from Atlas ORV also. Oh, okay. The only thing right now, he's only into the Polaris stuff right now, but I'm sure he'll eventually get on the Can-Am trade. Can <laughs> side, right? Everybody does. Well, I think there's a lot more uh, Polarises out there, but you know, we're working on it. We're they're, working they're, on. they're fan favorite, really. <laughs> fan favorite. Uh, anyways, what are we doing today? So I think so. We're gonna do some testing with these rods. That's... Not on this machine. No. This is just for show. He's got uh, some spares. We're gonna do yeah. a little weight test with, and uh, maybe jump the dodge. I don't know. Apparently, we can lift my whole truck with one arm. Yeah. Really? Is what he told me. So I don't know. Really? We might find that out today. I wonder if we could winch it up a tree somehow. I don't know if we have a tree big enough I mean, in this field. <laughs> we might have to get the tractor out for that. Yeah, we could have a pull yeah. test. So apparently these are the, the first uh, first ones he ever really made. They were just like a trial. Okay. So these are our testing. And they're nice and light too. Yeah, they're so light. Like literally like... Light and very strong. Sweet. Nice right. bad boys. We're gonna see what we can what we can lift with these things. A little bend test. So I don't know if we're gonna try if we're gonna bend them like this way or sideways. I don't know. Because if you're if it's on the machine this way, you think the impact would be yeah sideways. That's how I usually bend right? them. Unless you jump. It might be pretty hard to bend. Well, at least this one that way. This one 
should be easier to bend sideways, but the way we mount it, it's probably just gonna want to yeah. flip, right? So the weakest point would be at these, like obviously at these joints, but yeah. it says, they can handle like 12,000 pounds. I don't know. All right, well, let's give let's her a little more. We should have, I don't know if you saw that dump truck pull out here. We should have told him to stay down here. I didn't see that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're dumping, There's so much nice dirt down dumping here Dumping some more dirt, so. I want to hit these jumps. Let's do it. Hope you got your helmet on. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, uh, Razor Scooter Jay. Razor Scooter, <laughs> scooter Jay. Nice Should we get that dump truck to run over those rods? That'd be pretty heavy, eh? Let's buzz over there and ask him. Easy turbo, no launch control here. We gotta get to the dump truck before it leaves again. Look at these old tires. All right. As long as he doesn't push it. <laughs> we bent it. <laughs> That's good. How heavy is this thing? Thirteen thousand. He said twelve. All right, let's back over it now. Over that one. Yeah. That's a lot of weight. Keep going. <laughs> okay. So maybe they're not that strong, but... Well, 13,000 pounds, I mean, that's though. That's a lot of weight. That's going to bend anything, there's right? There's no weight in the trails. So you're getting that. <laughs> you're getting a dump truck. Ugh. Awesome. That's a good test, I mean... Beauty. Oh, 30,000 kilos, so, I mean. So 30,000 pounds. Okay. okay I mean, well, I mean, there you go. <laughs> yeah. But honestly, the 30,000 pounds, that's pretty good. Yeah, right? that's pretty impressive. Uh, beauty. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> all right, let's get back at it. So all these jumps have been redone. Time to see how they do with the side-by-side. -side. Nicely. You always gotta maintain the track. You gotta use it as much as possible or you know what happens. This grass starts growing quick. Freaking love that berm. That berm's been there for years. Right. 
right there. He's right there. He's feeling it. He's getting his legs in. He hasn't jumped anything in a long time. It's been a while. Yeah, some of those new dirt's pretty loose, so definitely need to maintain it after everyone rides it anyways. Juice, Jay. A little more. <laughs> there he is. Yay! Woo! He did it. <laughs> oh, fall down. Man, there's no food when you get out I know. Of you're so close every time. You're just catching the just the last little lip there. Yeah, I'll do another one. Yeah, I'll do some slow mos. himself. The old Atlas door of the arms holds up well. He's got her landed perfect here again. He's got her. He's got her. There it is. <laughs> hey! He's pumped. <laughs> Woo! High five! No! Dude, it like, it, it like pitches perfect. It's so good. <laughs> okay, one more time. Well, yeah, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to do slow-mo, so I hit her a couple more times okay, now. Okay. okay. That was good. <laughs> Jay's on fire. Mr. Dump Chucks, we got Lucy's there, dumping loads, we got Jay, dumping stuff. Oh yeah, that was sick. You feel? Oh. You got the inner berm, I think we're just hugs you and then you push Oh yeah, down. yeah. And it's not as much as a drop off at the end anymore. They should almost add some dirt here at the end so you can come out know, straighter. Yeah, or well, even just like more of an edge so if you do slide off the end, like yeah, you're good. Yeah, you're in a freaking ditch. Yeah, exactly. This is an even bigger boy, or bigger toy for the bigger boys. A little breezy down here today. Oh yeah, it's looking good. Lots and lots and lots of dirt. In <laughs> my shot. Whoa. <laughs> Jeez, that was too much fun here. Perfect jump for that thing. The 
The old Centaur, AKA Sherp, definitely demolished this thing. We did jump and it landed upside down like a pancake if you haven't already saw that video. What's Jay up to here? I was thinking about jumping that today, but he's got to go now, so. Maybe tomorrow, maybe next week, I don't know. There's always time for another time. Yeah, and then we were, we had a little target practice day here. Oh, dumping more dirt over there. We had a little target practice day, and this is all the shrapnel from the target. Not wild. You wouldn't want to get hit in the face with shrapnel, that's for sure. What's he doing here? Little speed demon. <laughs> yeah, so those are shotgun holes. And this is just shadow. So the target was up here and it was basically bouncing off. And yeah, look at that. Pepper. I just can't believe these holes. Like, absolutely insane. <laughs> he just doesn't want to go home. <laughs> I think the step down is definitely possible. You have to look at it. As long as it doesn't bounce you forward, right? It's basically just a drop off. Time for some new trucks though. New freshies. I was really open to jump that, but that was just gonna happen. Load her up! Yeah, the buggy trailer. Yeah. There's a weird clunking noise, I don't know. The player thing. Summer, this grows five inches a day. Look how small this trailer is compared to his other one. Oh, yeah. Good shift. Well, anyways, I'm Jeff. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you follow Bull 8 Rims, Super ATV. Atlas ORV. Look at these dang things. Those look so sick. Make sure you follow Razor J on the gram. Give him a few shout outs. And uh, don't do anything we wouldn't do. Get yourself a Can Am Polaris. Can Am Polaris. Can Amorous. Can Amorous. Right. Next time we're going to bend this one. this one. We're going to try to do it though, like the uh, long ways. Vertical ways. Vertical ways. Instead of that ways yeah this one i mean for thirty thousand pounds come on yeah pretty i think you're not running the, into a stump at thirty thousand no, pounds of pressure thirty thousand pounds would have snapped or bent everything and i mean you anything. could probably still drive it out man mm -hmm. yeah, sure i'll yeah. just flatten it back out anyways thank you guys again check out the links below and we'll see you later bye later.